I'm Stacey Vanderwolp. I am the project manager for the LTER research project at the Kellogg Biological Station. We are out here this morning sampling greenhouse gas from our main cropping system experiment. To do that, we come out with four or five people. We sample gas from a chamber or static collar that's installed in the plots. This is an open collar that's installed about four inches, two to four inches deep. To sample gas from the collar, we come and put a lid on that chamber with a um, hole in the center and a rubber septa. So we can use a syringe and a needle to extract gas sample from the headspace of that chamber. We do that immediately after putting the lid on, and then we come back to that same chamber four more times over the course of about 45 minutes and collect a sample each time. So then we can use that sample, those four samples, to calculate a flux or a change in the gas inside that headspace across that time period. We use data loggers, both inside and outside the chamber, to track temperature. So we can look at whether the inside of the chamber, when closed off, changes in relation to the outside. We analyze those samples for carbon dioxide and methane and nitrous oxide back in the lab. We are interested in knowing um, those greenhouse gases, whether they're being released or taken up by the microbes in the soil. So we can compare the greenhouse gas that we see from say a continuous corn plot to that of a successional field or an organic corn plot 